welcome back. Today we're going to check out Roger. All right, so it's a little breakdown. Four-seam fastball, changeup, curveball, and a Roger two-seam fastball. Again, most legendary pitchers have their own special pitch. And, of course, right now I'm at level 12, not fully maxed out. So you can kind of just add the stats. His spin, pretty good. Velocity is probably the best in the game. It used to be better, but, again, they nerfed it a little bit. Thank God. All right, and, again, after he gives up a hit, he gets kind of angry or rage. So his four-seam fastball increases in speed for the next batter. And, again, for a hitter, pretty much if he's 13, 168 all around. And at level 12, 153 all around. All right, so today we're going to create a game here and play against Roger in a more controlled atmosphere. Kind of give you a better look at the pitches, so to speak. All right. By the way, this is my secondary account. And day one in, already have about 2,100 trophies. You could do it, guys. Getting trophies, it's not hard. All right, so as you can see, my level 12, uh, Roger, not very good. Don't use him very often, but that's okay. So, again, we're pitching here. We're the home team. And here we go. So we're going to take a look at his two-seam fastball, up high and tight. And, again, right-handed pitcher has that kind of inward-outward kind of like a cutter. And then the changeup, if you look at it, oh, excuse me, this would be a four-seam four fastball. Again, has a little subtle movement outside to inside. All right. And one of his best pitches here is you look at the curveball. It is about that kind of it starts at 12 o'clock, goes to about 7 o'clock. So it's big, loopy. It's very de deceitful. And you can kind of fool a lot of people with it. Kind of has a big, big drop. So and then the changeup. Let's take a look at the changeup. Now, a lot of times with the changeup, I like to pair it up, for example, I like to pair it up with, if I can get a fastball here on the inside, right, and then what I would try to do is get a fastball here on the outside, and usually, it, you know, if they typically, they might be able to foul it off, and then I usually go high. With the four seam fastball again you're using the fastball as the main weapon right that's the main pitch you want to use and then you drop it down and you could drop it down a little lower you don't have to throw a strike here usually you can get the batter to kind of chase at times right all right sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't work if a good batter has a good eye All right, so the curveball inside definitely works out pretty well, and you know a lot of times when you're when you work with Roger, it he gets kind of tough. You got to use that fastball, you got to hit the corners, got to be, you got to kind of try to deceive the batter. It's it's really the best opportunity you're going to have with Roger. In a lot of opinions, people use that speed, right? That's his main thing is pitching with speed, and when you could do that. It, it really becomes a lot a lot easier in my opinion all right so let's take a look from the other side so my other account Roger 16 and one he is pretty much a beast all right so let's see how it comes a four seam fastball is coming down the pipe from our view all right pretty straight not a lot of movement all right all right so we take a look at the two seamer all right, a little bit of movement on the outside. Now we look at that changeup and see what we can see what the changeup, how that drop happens. See, that's a big drop, even at level nine where they're at right now. And then finally, let's take a look at that curveball. Let's see kind of where it goes. Starts up and like I said, pretty, pretty tough pitch to kind of lay off of if it's thrown in the right spot for a ball. All right, so let's check out that rage pitch. All right, again, level nine, not always going to work. All right, so again, we're going to check out a changeup and see how that kind of works for us. 
All right. So again, it, start, it starts at the top of the zone, goes to the bottom of the zone, works out pretty well. All right. And again, that curveball, again, placed in the right spot. Right? A little outside. All right. Okay. So there's about five minutes with Roger. We don't need to see any more than that. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.